It somehow got worse. It somehow got worse. Okay, so let me explain what happened. For those of you who've been living under a rock for the last couple of hours, Premier League referee David Coote uh, was... there. A, a video came out where he called Jurgen Klopp the C-word, said Liverpool were shit, called Jurgen Klopp arrogant, called him a German C-word, because let's throw a bit of xenophobia and racism in there, why not? And ended the video with um, someone saying, we hate Scousers, and, and Coop not doing anything to deny that he does. So, Coop gets suspended, not instantly sacked, because, God forbid, he get instantly sacked. And his excuses started coming out. He started with, oh, it's AI. Then he was like, okay, it is an AI, it is actually me. Then he was like, oh, it is me, but I can't remember it. But that's not even what I'm wanting to talk about in this video. Let me read you guys something, okay? Let me read you something, and then I'm going to go off. Get it up here. This is a tweet on Twitter from Francis Paletti. Staggering. Reports suggest that the PGO, the PGMOL was made aware of a video circling of David Coote shortly after it was recorded. So, not a couple of days before it was leaked. Shortly after it was recorded. What? What do you mean you were made aware of it after it was recorded? Okay, uh, what did they do about it? Coote was allegedly removed from officiating Liverpool matches in the Premier League, but was later, but later resumed duties in a less capacity as a video assistant and a fourth official. Yeah, because he, he can't do any harm as a video assistant. Can't do any harm as a video assistant. I'm sure. I'm sure he can't can do something. To potentially sway matches against Liverpool. Who was a video assistant? Sure, it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. He was eventually reinstated as a as a referee for for Liverpool in the Premier League, having not officiated a Liverpool match in the league for about four years until he took charge of a game against Brighton. And Anfield in March of this year. So, what does that mean? They knew. They knew. You, you kidding me? Sue them. Sue them. John W. Henry, you have an unlosable lawsuit right here. Sue these bastards into administration. Are you kidding me? They knew. They knew. And the best they can do is t take him off Liverpool games and then eventually put him back as a video assistant. Because there's no way he can impact games in those capacities, right? R right? Oh my god, are you kidding me? This, the PGMOL should be sued into oblivion by Liverpool Football Club. 
And I don't care if Gary Neville wants to cry ass about me using about those words. Or, it's, or about Liverpool looking into it. And motherfucker, we should have sued him after the Tottenham game. John W. Henry, if you do anything in good it in it again in your time as Liverpool loner Sue There's so much money to be made here. There's so much money that we missed out on. Cause, cause because of this, we lost revenue for the last four three or four years. They knew, and they didn't do anything about it except a light slap on the wrist. I mean, I don't know if you know just what I did. They only took him off of Liverpool games. I'm sure... He doesn't have any controversial decisions in games that might have affected Liverpool. Oh, wait. He does. Three or four years. They knew. Not three or four days. He's after the video was before the video was late. It's not like they got a pre warning that something might come out and be like, "This might come out." Just saying, because if they got a warning that a video might be leaked, they could have easily he he ignored it and been like, "Ah, this is probably AI or not something." And then it comes out and they realize, oh, shit. No. They knew. They knew this video existed. They knew they uh, existed. And they didn't do a damn thing except a light slap on the wrist. Howard Webb and everyone else in a position of power at the PGMOL should be immediately bundled onto a plane, flown over to the States, and slapped in Guantanamo Bay. They're criminals! John W. Henry, I hope you sue them! And you will win. You will absolutely win. It is in this is it is enough. This is enough. To quote DA Drogba in that Champions League semi-final against Barcelona a years ago. It's a disgrace. It's a fucking disgrace. Three or four years they knew. They knew this video was out there. And the best they could do is take him off Liverpool games for a bit. Not look into it. Not do an investigation then. Hmm? Hmm? And this proves it's not AI. Because AI wasn't as good as it, it might be now. Hell. AI is still not good enough to make that video. Oh, and the fact that there's a second video with him saying in the first video can't go out. So, clearly it's not AI. Just FYI. But, oh my god, are you kidding me? They knew. They knew! If I were John W. Henry, I would already be talking to lawyers. I would already be looking in, in, for who is going to represent me and make me millions 
Because that is how much we've been screwed over and robbed of by the PGMOL's lack of... I don't even know what the word is. Herring? They didn't care. And why? Because it was Liverpool, of course. Nobody will care if we screw over Liverpool. Who cares? It's only Liverpool. They'll whine and cry, bitch and moan, and everyone and everyone will laugh. Well, who's laughing now, motherfuckers? We are. We were proven right about Coot. There's more bad apples that we've complained about, and I guarantee you, there's something on them. John W. Henry should sue who? the PGMOL into oblivion. If he has any sense, that's what he'll do. Don't listen to the pundits. Fuck them. Because they're in the pocket of Sky Sports who are trying to who spin the narrative that um, everyone says says that. Everyone says stuff like that when they think they're not being recorded. The problem is, Coot knew he was being recorded. He knew he was being recorded, and yet he still fucking said it. He has no excuse. He needs to be sacked immediately. Forget this investigation nonsense, because you'll probably just give him a light slap on the wrist. He needs to be sacked, and the PG EMOL needs to be sued. John W. Henry, there is millions on the table waiting for you. All you need to do is get the right lawyer. And like I said, you could probably pluck someone fresh out of law school and they win this shit for you. This needs to elicit massive change in football. This is why we need the government in the United Kingdom to install somebody to oversee he, he, the day-to-day -day runnings of football. Because they can't be trusted to govern themselves. They can't be trusted. And they've proven it because they knew about this video for three or four fucking years. Sue them. And sue them now, John. And I guarantee you, you will not regret.